Hey guys, back again with uh, another video. Hey, back again with another video. This thing, which I can be talking about in a few minutes. Uh, I don't even remember when I picked it up. I know where I got it, I just don't. I think it was several months ago. And normally I don't pay this much for something. But, I was sort of a sucker and it was stupid. So now there's no explanation why. The, my grand plan was to take this and put Windows 98 on it. I have a portable Windows 98 machine. Except that um, uh, there weren't exactly drivers for this for Windows 98. There were, but there weren't. If, uh, I'd explain. So, basically what occurred was... Balance the mount. Uh, I saw it, and they wanted uh, sixteen dollars for it, and that's a tad too expensive for my taste. But I stupidly said yes, because I had some master plan that I would install Windows ninety eight on it and have this retro portable gaming machine. So, enough about that. Let's go over the machine. This is a Sony Vio, as you very well can see. The model is PCG FXA33. Let's angle up the camera so you can get a better view. This is running a, I will turn on, but I'm trying to remember, I think it's a Pentium 3 with 512 megabytes of RAM and like a 20 gigabyte hard drive or something. Move this back, put this down. Okay, so I'm gonna plug in the AC adapter. There is some slight damaging to the uh, computer itself. I'll go over that now. There's normal trackpad where, as you can see, it's it's shiny in the middle, just a uh, general dust. But on the side, there's a crack where someone probably threw or dropped this and all the rubber feet are gone from the top this lid actually can fold all the way back so it can fold completely flat why you would want a computer in this configuration that isn't touch screen I, I don't know so let's get this back into a normal orientation I may need to move the camera for a brief second to get this better situated. Hopefully that angle is going to be okay. I had to do a quick jump cut so I could actually get the camera positioned. I don't know if the tripod's crooked, but I really don't care right now. So we have the AC adapter plugged in. The unit is booting up. It has a an optical drive. It's a CD uh, read writable DVD read drive. I put Windows XP on this. I think Windows XP Service Pack Two. I I mainly use it for light web browsing and typing. Originally, my plan was to install Windows ninety eight and have a retro PC, so that's why I even purchased it. But there are drivers for the video, there are drivers for the I.O., but there are no drivers for 
the audio within Windows 98. I don't know if that's just because that, that like, um, I don't know if that's just because um, Windows 98 doesn't support this hardware or the other way around that this hardware doesn't support <laughs> Windows 98, but it's kind of frustrating because everything else worked, but not the audio. I installed generic drivers and everything else, and it comes down to basically that Sony used a proprietary sound chip. I forgot what sound system they put in it, and it basically limits what drivers can be installed. This supports Windows 2000, and strangely enough, Windows 7, but it doesn't support Windows 98. So if we go over to Computer, right-click, Properties, uh, you can see it is, oh, okay, it's an AMD Duron, actually, 900 megahertz with 512 megabytes of RAM. Don't worry, I will be getting a better camera real soon. I, just for now, I wanted to do some of these videos, and at this distance, at this focal distance, it's fine doing this. You can read, I mean, it's like, uh, at distance. So yeah, this is mostly for typing. I have uh, Office 2003 installed. I have VLC, which I was using to watch some uh, DVDs, which surprisingly, if they're of earlier DVDs, like late 90s, early 2000s, and the codec isn't too heavy, they work fairly well with this, but anything newer than about like uh, trying to think of a DVD that would have a newer codec. Um, anything newer than about Juno, it starts to chug because of the encoding of the DVD. Um, that's that's about it for this laptop. It it was actually a rather poor financial decision on my part, considering the fact that I it wasn't it's not gonna like bankrupt me, but it's really not that useful because I already have a Windows XP a computer. I mean I. I have this guy, which incidentally is another bio. You've you've seen this one on my channel before, so but yeah, the the uh, the white one. Woohoo! Um that one is a little bit better for doing XP like stuff. So I might try to flip this one, because just to get some of the money back. Uh, this has been Zesty Panda with uh, another video. If you like this, uh, if you like this, thumbs it up. If you didn't, thumbs it down. Leave a comment down below, and make sure to subscribe if you like this stuff. If you didn't, then I don't know why you're watching this. I have an awesome day.